Hello and welcome to episode number 30 of this Let's Play Songs of Six here at Hannibal Nora's YouTube channel. Now, last episode we uh, basically tossed away that, oh, almost our entire army because uh, uh, we were so low on workers that uh, it wasn't even fun anymore. Um, yeah, we also are struggling with food. Um, hopefully, hopefully, hopefully that uh, this will be built and this big farm here will be built eventually. But I, I do think this is going to take a while for us to build. The uh, reason is simple. Uh, oh, we don't have any vegetables to plant. They, they are kind of working on the farm now. That, that's good. That is good. Uh, so we're trying to get up to 850. I think that is what we set the population limit at. Uh, we are um, currently building a bathhouse because we unlocked that yesterday. Or last time I streamed. Uh, we also spent a bunch of science points and then we lost a bunch of science points. So, oh, here we go. I don't want to buy any of you, but um, let's get some of these. 2.3 million. I don't need that many. Let's say... How much money do we have? We have 20... 40,000. So we should be able to buy some of them. Alright, so we'll buy seven Crotonians. Come and be my slaves. Good, good. Alright, let's go to warp speed. See if they can finish off some of this. Now this is going to be a warehouse. I think we'll put primarily food and coal in this warehouse. Uh, we'll wait until they finish that. There we go. Uh, so, uh, the reason why we're putting coal in here is basically because um, we need that to heat up the bathhouse. If I recall this correctly, does it say anything? Wait, did we un... Oh, no. Did we lose that? Oh, we did. We did lose that. Oh, well. Well, hopefully they will uh, they, they will still remember how to build it. Still had the blueprints for it. Um, wow. <laughs> um, what was it? It was logistic warehouse. So we will put one of you in here. Sort of food. Food and coal. So we're probably going to... I don't know. Should we do it that way? I kind of feel like we could get more out of it if we put it in this direction. Like so, because then we can... Do something like that. Alright. And how is my slaves doing? They are they are doing fine. They are doing fine. So we have now 63 workers. That is uh, just the thing I would like to see. Um, okay, so if we go into the army now. You're in the army now. And crank you up by one. That means we have now 33 workers. I, I think we're going to have to gradually just increase our army like that. And also, our food per day, or our daily food storage, is uh, going up. Which is a good thing. Uh, did we increase that by... Well, we did increase it. That's all that matters. That is all that matters. Um, now we're going to get a little bit of an issue here. When this is done. Hmm. They really don't eat a lot of mushrooms, do they? I, I think we only have one little mushroom cave. Well, it's not very little. But, uh, oh gosh, the cat is up to something. I heard him. <laughs> Heard him doing some not naughty stuff out there. What was it you were doing, kitty cat? <laughs> my. My, oh my. Alright, so we are starting on the warehouse. Uh, we also wanted to have 
Do we want to have a cantina or do we want to have... Hmm. I kind of feel like we would like to have... I mean, we have a cantina up here, don't we? Tavern and cantina. So maybe we'll have an eatery down here. Uh, food. Eatery. Excuse me, there we go. And there we go, we need some storages. Actually, we can get a... Oh. Could potentially get a couple of those. that and then that there we go that's perfect perfect then this is done uh, we were supposed to be making some sort of housing unit in here uh, we are gonna be making apartments because uh, that is nice live in an apartment and just not just share like uh, a room with two million other people um, civics service isn't that what they were underneath so a flat house the ikea house so um let's see here apartments okay we'll start here Oh, that works perfectly. And then we can add some in here. And then we'll just fill it up with knickknacks and, and all the good stuff the game has to offer. Um, oh gosh, this is going to take forever to... Uh, let's make it like a large carpet in here. Let's try not to do that. Let's put in a big knickknack instead. It's all about the big knickknacks. We're up to 88%. Put one in here. There we go, 100%. Good. Couple of apartments in here. This was supposed to be a poop house. So let's see if we can get that one working. Hygiene, poop house. And we also wanted to have another, I wonder if we should make that into like, um, A dormitory. Is this gonna work? No. Uh, let's make it a little bit awkward for these people here. There we go. So now they can sit and watch each other do their thing. Uh, I'll put in some basins in here. Like so. And this was supposed to be like a tiny little dormitory, wasn't that it? Because I, I don't think, I do not think we can fit in a flat house apartment here. It's going to be a very tiny one. Well, we could. Now you. We'll remove you. Is 
If we did that and just moved the bench down a little bit. And we'll put in a little carpet down here. Just for the sake of argument. And then we'll have to adjust this uh, building here. So structure, wooden buildings. We would like to have the door here and a wall here. All right, things are being built. Uh, the well was built. Uh, we're down to 14 workers, is that? Oh yeah, that means we have finished you. You have only four workers, that's fine. And here we are missing like two bajillion uh, vegetables. Perfect. Fertility is only at 35%. Not perfect, but um, it is what it is. We are kind of... We kind of have to utilize the, the f all the fertile areas that we can. Why did we drop down to six workers? Did we finish something up here? Well, we kind of did. So this was supposed to be a dormitory, if I remember correctly. Uh, where we kind of wanted to make rooms and such. And that was also supposed to be... Oh, I can't remember. What was that supposed to be? <laughs> no idea. Oh, man. So long since I recorded. So I'm, I'm recording a couple of uh, episodes um, back to back here now. So we'll do something like that. have like a large row of beds here and we can also potentially squeeze you in here and then all the good knickknacks all the good knickknacks of the world unite there we go put one knickknack in here uh, no they don't have carpets in this so we're already at 100%, so we'll do something like that. Could potentially squeeze in. So you're supposed to go here, remove you, put a bed in here instead. Like so. So I kind of feel like this kind of reminds me a little bit of like a little termite mound. Is that what it's called? A termite mound? I'm also curious. Are they going to build these? Do we want more slaves? I mean, we have so many already. Uh, we only have 9,000, so we can potentially buy a couple, only two. All right, we'll buy two slaves. There we go. So we're up to... Uh, I wonder, are we making clothes somewhere? So we are making the clothes out of leather, isn't that what we're doing? And we have plenty of leather. Well, there we don't have very many workers. Where do they all go? Leather tailor, warehouse. Why do we have? Why did we make a warehouse way up here? Is it because of the farm? That could be. Now, when I clicked on that, they kind of said, oh, gosh, there's a lot of free fruit here. So they went and grabbed all of that. Uh, that was not good. But yeah, I'm very curious if they're going to be able to build this bathhouse here. 
because I think that will kind of increase. Oh, this is done. So we'll um, auto employ some workers here. We'll say two of those, two of those, uh, not of those, two bread, two fruit, two meat, two mushrooms, two vegetables. Uh, we definitely would like to have charcoal here. I also wonder if we would like to have stone and these here. Yeah. Uh, we might want to have at least one with um, metal uh, for repairing. Uh, maybe pottery we're going to need. We're going to put in some tools in here. I think we're also going to put one in here with... Um, with big stones, so we can repair the statues and such. Speaking of repairing, do we have a janitor nearby? Ooh. Uh, I wouldn't know. Some clothing might be nice down here. Uh, maybe some weapons as well. Do we have weapons stored somewhere? Yeah, we have weapons stored up there, so we'll we'll be fine there. Uh, we'll um, put in some more food in here. The more food we can store, the better. Well, the more food we can produce is probably better than the amount of food we... Okay, so we can get one of you and one of you. There we go. So we have filled up this warehouse now. Uh, hopefully the, that will contribute to um, getting us a little bit more uh, spread between the good... Like, they don't have to travel too far to get the goods. Uh, we did put workers in here, so that should be a thing. And we're also going to have to figure out where we are putting our janitors, because I, I feel we don't have many janitors down here, do we? We have one here. And it seems like yeah, they might be a struggling a little bit. Actually... I don't think they are, because if that was the case, they would have filled up the workers here, right? So maybe not. Maybe not. I have one roll of fabric, and it's grey. Oh my. Uh, this one is done. Excellent. 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 Um, let's uh, get some roads in here. And let's also get some decorations down here, because... Uh, that might be nice. Um, when we think about this, we wanted this to be a three wide road. So uh, let's get... Oh, it might not be a three wide road. Actually, it will be. We'll make it so. Like so. And let's see, you were coming out here. Let's put down some torch, maybe. Put down a torch here. Torch here. Torch here. And let's also put down some big trees here and here. Uh, maybe one down here. I kind of just want to have some random, random decorations around here. I mean, it doesn't matter if it's kind of aligned, because, you know, it's trees, right? And these are elves. Elves on the shelves. Yep. I, I went there. There we go. <laughs> All right. And we're still minus five workers. That is acceptable. Kinda. They are building it. So, so, so they still know how to build it. Um, but I just don't think we can build more of them. Yeah, that makes sense, potentially. Um, they still... 
We had a plan here, didn't we? A eatery, wasn't that it? Eatery and a poopery. All right, where is the closest toilet? That's down here. And it seems like that we have fairly good coverage on the poopery side of, th of things. Gosh, I can't remember what we were planning to build down here. Uh, okay, so poopery are okay. Um, uh, that was a cantina. Cantina is not going to be okay because we have so few of them. Like here we have none. So maybe we'll squeeze in a cantina in here. Right, one thing at a time here. Um... Alright, eateries. Where are you, eateries? Yeah, they are not very good. Okay, so I think we are plan. Oh, wait, we have a warehouse here. What was our initial plan here? <laughs> I have no idea. I have absolutely no idea. Uh, we'll just fill it in with. Um, I don't know. Could do a school of some sort. I mean, our knowledge is, uh, it's not great. Oh, if we do school. Well, we do already have paper makers. We are, well, yeah. Okay, well, we'll put in a little school here. Or maybe not a school. Uh, maybe, um. Huh. Knowledge. Maybe a library. Yeah, we'll put down a library here. We don't have that yet. Um, so a library and a little storage for for paper. Yeah, seems like a good idea. So um, let's get one of these in here. Have the scribe here, and then we'll just fill the rest off with shelves. Uh, it's not going to be many shelves, it looks like. Alright, we'll do that. And then this was supposed to be a warehouse. Uh, logistics warehouse with a little paper thingy. This is probably not what, what I initially had thought. But okay. So a little paper storage in there. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We need some carpets in here. All right, wipe your feet before you go in. Same here. Kind of do like having some just random elements into these buildings because it makes it look a little bit more alive, I think. If you don't, if you kind of go for a little bit more of organic and not everything is... Um, like a communist ho housing block, if that makes sense. Everything is the same. But yeah, it, it probably wasn't our initial idea to do that, was to put down... Um, put down that here, somewhat about leather, warehouse. Could put down it. Okay, we'll put down an eatery here as well. So we'll make... Um, it doesn't need to be a big seven. Seven. Eight. 
like so. Uh, we'll have the door coming out here, I think. Like so. And then we can have the row coming in like that, because there's probably going to be some of these here that also would like to go and, and shop and eat. Alright, how are things coming along? We are missing quite a lot of things. Mainly stone. Oh, we're very low on stone. And cut stone. Well, it's just a matter of getting them from point A to point B. I think. Now if we put fetch on these. Like so. And also coal, very important. So now they will try to actively go out and search for these goods and try and fill up the warehouse. All right, our food per like our daily food storage is going up, so we now have a, a week, a week of uh, of stuff, also known as food. The bathroom is ready. Alright, eatery is uh, we are very low on uh, pottery as well. Let's go down to Claytown. Claytown could have... Hmm. How are we doing with clay in general? Clay is fine. I think it's getting more workers in here. Kind of would help it a little bit, hopefully. So if I put that back down here again, then we'll figure out. They'll they'll figure it out, I guess. Um. Hmm. Did we ever make a marketplace, like a, a general marketplace? I, I know we made something up here. So you are exporting furniture. You are exporting pottery because we were doing very well uh, a while ago. I don't think we have any Let's see here. We are All right. Let, let's also make one for 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 um what's it what's it called um we'll make one for hide there we go and they are in the logistic export um oh we can actually fit it in here was it that big Where do we want to have our hide export? I kind of feel like we would like to have... Maybe we'll have that up here. Yeah, we'll do that. So we'll uh, export our, um, our access um, leather. I do have a feeling this is going to be built very quickly, but uh, we will see, we will see. Oh, there it goes, there it goes. All right, so we are going to be exporting hides from here. And our goal is to... If we are over, let's say, 688... Because we kind of are already full, right? And let's also automatically assign workers to that. Uh, do we want to do the same with these? We have done that. 
And we have done that. And we did the same up here for drinks. I don't think... I, in the beginning, I thought we were making a lot of drinks, but uh, obviously we weren't. Because it would have been silly if we were actually making uh, making smart choices here, right? Also bread. 10%. So if we have more than <laughs> uh, 3,900 bread, we will sell. Same with the drinks here. seems to be going fine oh hello they actually uh, they actually did something here let's um, store mainly paper here put an employee in there just for sake of argument so now we should be producing a little bit more uh, science points or knowledge uh, you were supposed to be a tiny little, I don't know, kiosk or something like that. So we'll put in food, eateries. There we go. And I think we can just uh, deal with uh, something like that. Like so. And there's the cat again. So, uh, so yeah. Um, I think we are at the end of the episode. Let's see here. 32 minutes. So we kind of are already above the 30-minute marks. So, uh, so, yeah. I think we'll call it here. We're still hoping that we will be able to get this uh, bathhouse up and running one day, hopefully. And uh, maybe next episode, we'll try and take a look at the knowledge points. I think that would be a good idea. Yeah, I, I know a kitty cat. So, uh, so yeah, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't already, there is a like button and a comment button and... Well, not a comment button, but a comment section and a like button. Of course, YouTube took away the dislike button, so... Uh, I can see it, you cannot see it, but uh, if you didn't like it, feel free to press that dislike button anyway. Uh, <laughs> but uh, but if you like it, I, I really hope you will press the like button. It all helps fight that pesky YouTube algorithm. But yeah, again, thank you so much for watching, and until next time, take care, and keep smiling!